Hey guys and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be doing an HK416 for Gunsmith Part 14. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to open it and do edit build. Uh, that's new text there, but uh, yeah, so we're going to be doing edit build and then we're going to be following the Tarkov wiki and what it's saying is we should be using the EXP S3. Uh, we're going to be removing this and put the M bus there, the tan one specifically, and we are actually are going to be using the Midwest 9 inch here. Uh, and then following that, we're actually going to leave the, the latch the same. Uh, and we're actually going to be changing the barrel out to the 11 inch uh, and then changing the stock to the uh, the UBR Gen 2. And then we're going to be setting the stand mag, uh, do, 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 just a normal stand mag right there. And then the grip, we're going to be setting it to the Mo, uh, MOE. So we're going to be looking for that one here. There it is, the AR-15 MOE. And then following that, we're going to put on the uh, four inch rail, 4.1 inch rail. Then we're going to put the RVG on it. And for the gas block, um, actually we're not on the gas block yet. Uh, for the barrel, we're going to be wanting to put the SF3P. Uh, we got to find where that is right here, the 556SF3P. And then we're going to put that tan F556RC2 uh, silencer on it. And then the, for the gas block itself, there's only one option for this uh, for this extension here. And then we're going to put the other M bus on it. And then following that, we're actually going to put the LA. 5b on it and there you go you should have your final build so i'm going to save that as gs part 14 and save and we're going to hit assemble by parts it's going to be 130k on top of the silencer in value it is using some uh, usd so i need to go and buy the silencer as well and as you can see here it's going to be assembled and if i exit out we do not have the check mark so we have to check where this issue could be. Hey guys, I think I saw, I found the issue and that's going to be on the side here. We actually are going to put the M lock RL and that's going to be adding that plus one ergonomics that we need uh, in order to turn it in. That's why we didn't have the check mark before. And if we assemble it here, it should be all set with that check mark. And if we go to traders, mechanic, task, gunsmith, turn in, there you go. We can finally turn it in. Thanks guys for watching and please leave a like and comment down below. And if there's anything you guys like to see, make sure you hit that subscribe button and I'll see you guys next time later.